Tonight, clients of an Aurora bankruptcy company are concerned that the business may have gone under itself. Appointments have been canceled, private documents left behind. Dylan Thomas, following this story for us tonight, and Dylan, some people have shared with you that they are in even deeper debt after seeking help there. Karen, we spoke to one man who said he came to this business seeking financial help. Instead, he walked away $250 deeper in debt without any answer to his problem. Tonight, this building is cleared out and the door, it's locked. Something which definitely was not the case when some looked for answers just weeks ago. After an injury impacted his ability to work full time, Preston Prani found On My Own Bankruptcy Online a company which could solve his issue for $250. They took my money, my documents. But when he showed up for a scheduled appointment, walking through unlocked doors. There were bankruptcy and divorce files lying all over the place. Nobody was there. Prunty filmed as he saw documents with social security numbers and bank information scattered. The filing cabinet was open with hundreds of files. Um, it's just there for anyone to grab and and take someone's information. In an email, management said they wouldn't refund Prani's money. Interactions which caught the Better Business Bureau off guard. There was nothing very alarming on their profile. On my own bankruptcy and divorce only averaged one complaint a year, but this one caused the bureau to revoke the company's A rating. We do have an investigations department that is aware of it and is already looking into it. Until that is complete, Prani just wants his money and bank documents back in his own hands. It took me quite a while to, to save $250. And uh, again, I, I, can't, I can't go somewhere else until I get that money back. Now, management claims that this office was not locked just weeks ago as they were moving. We spoke to a manager from On My Own earlier today. She says her company's history should speak for itself, saying that her company was a good company. Well, Prentney tells us that she can use that defense in the near future when he sees her in court. We're live in Aurora, Dylan Thomas, CBS 4 News.